Hello everyone, welcome to HIM 130. This lecture is going to take you through the DRG listing. This is in week three for chapter five. And this is an Excel spreadsheet that we are going to be opening. And you have an assignment that requires you to use this DRG listing. And so once you get into the Excel spreadsheet, you're going to uh, click on the enable editing. Now, <clears throat> this, these DRGs, of course, are the same DRGs that you find in the DRG definition manual. I think this is a little easier to work with. You'll notice that in this column, this is the MSDRG. It is not this column. This is the, the number of the row. So we want to be in column A to determine what the MSDRG actually is. Columns B, C, and we are not concerned with columns B and C. We are really not concerned with column D or E. We are going to be using column A for the MSDRG and then F for the title and G for the weight. Um, you may have a table in that assignment that asks you to include the geometric and the arithmetic mean length of stay. That information is listed here as well. What you're doing in that assignment is identifying a family, as your textbook calls it, a DRG family. Um, typically, it's referred to as a triplicate. And these are DRGs that are impacted by a CC or an MCC. We're going to start by looking at, um, we can look at craniotomy. So obviously this is not one that you would use for the assignment. But if we look at DRG 025, we can see that this is craniotomy in endovascular intracranial procedures with an MCC. The weight is 4.4917. If we look at DRG 26, again, this is the craniotomy in endovascular intracranial procedure with a CC. That weight is lower. We know that because there is a difference in the weight, there will be a difference in the reimbursement. The craniotomy procedure with an MCC and a weight of 4.414917 is going to reimburse the facility more than the craniotomy with a CC and a weight of 3.0580. Remember that to determine the reimbursement for a specific DRG, we take that facility's base rate which is provided to the facility by CMS, and we multiply it by the weight of that DRG. So for instance, if my, my base rate was $1,000, and that's very hypothetical, $1,000 and I multiplied it by this weight, my reimbursement would be $4,449. For the DRG with a CC, it would be $3,000. Um, and $58. The next DRG in this triplicate is 027, and this is a craniotomy without a CC or an MCC. And again, remember that CMS has identified specific diagnosis codes that are either a complication comorbidity or a major complication comorbidity. And when those codes are combined with the principal diagnosis code and procedure code that groups to this particular, these particular MSDRGs, then the reimbursement is impacted. And I'll do an example of that in the tutorial for the assignment that demonstrates that. But for this third DRG in this triplicate, our weight, our DRG weight is 2.5118 and our reimbursement for this DRG with a base rate of $1,000 would be $2,500. This triplicate or family is DRG 024. I'm sorry, it's not. It's DRG 025, 026, and 027. You will find triplicates 
all through this listing of MSDRGs. So I encourage you to find a triplicate and you're going to be able to quickly identify them because you'll see that there is with it like this one, other ear, uh, nose, mouth, and throat. There's with MCC, without CC, without CC or MCC. And again, right, the one right beneath it is the same thing. This is a triplicate. Same description, but it includes with MCC, with CC, without CC or MCC. So I hope that's helpful for you. If not, please contact your instructor.